Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to show you how you guys can do these white pedestals that I have for a dessert table. So this setup was done for a client of mine who wanted the white uh, dessert stands and that's what I did for her. And towards the end, if you keep on watching, you'll see different type of pedestals that I created for another client of mine. Here are all the items that I'll be using for this project. So here I take the pine round wood and I take the nails and nail it through four different even uh, areas of this wood because then I'm going to be putting the square dowels under each uh, nail that I put through. Here you're going to see me take a dowel and put it right on top of that nail that I put through. I'm going to do that to each of the four corners and just hammer it down so that it goes right in. Please don't forget to subscribe to my channel so you can see more of my creations and what I do for a living as a party planner. Um, let me know if you want me to create more of these kind of videos or the ones that I'll be posting real soon with me organizing my house and cooking, cleaning, all those types of stuff. So here you're going to see me. I am going to put the other round uh, pine wood and hammer it in to all four of the square dowels. Yes, it looks like it's hard, but it's not. Fun fact about where I am creating all this is in my house that I'm living in now. Yes, it was under construction at that time. And I decided to take the opportunity and do it there. What I'm trying to do there is trying to put the nail through and make sure that it goes into that square dowel. So make sure that you actually hammer it into the square dowel and not just in air. <laughs> so this is how it's going to come out. Then I'm going to take this, I think it's poly wall. I'll take the sticker out. I measure it and then I'm going to be cutting it so that it's going to be the same length. You'll see me do that now. So, question for you guys, who can guess where in my house am I standing? Write in the comments down below and take a wild guess of which area of my house that I am working with now. Also, don't forget to like this video, it helps me out a lot. And don't forget to subscribe and tell all your friends about it. As you can see, this poly wall, as they call it, is very bendable and it's very durable as well. You can also stick on any wallpaper color that you want. As you're going to see towards the end, I'm going to show you that my next client who wanted these pedestals wanted a different color. And I forgot to videotape how I changed the color. But... All you have to do is get any any color that you want of wallpaper and you're just gonna stick it on and it looks so beautiful here you're gonna see me take half an inch nails and you're gonna see me nail it all through um, the side of the round wood I'm going to show you in a few.
make sure that you align it so that it won't go towards a different direction you have to make sure that it's straight very straight because if you mess up it's going to be very hard to undo it you're going to have to nail it piece by piece like literally uh, an inch away and you have to put a lot of nails in there so that it doesn't open on the sides so carefully just one inch away from the other nail and just keep going down and keep nailing it on both ends So here you have it, the white pedestal. All I did was just paint the top to just be all over white. Or like I've mentioned to you earlier, you can take wallpaper and just do like I did right here. This client of mine wanted a Spider-Man theme. She wanted the red, the blue, the black. So that's the wallpapers colors that I got and I just taped it all on and it stayed beautifully. You can do it any color. I'm in love with this style. If you love this video, please don't forget to hit the like, comment down below, and subscribe. I do appreciate it. Also, if you need a party planner, somebody who does balloons always reach out to me and you can follow my instagram page at modern creations by bella and i'll be more than happy to help you thank you guys so much for watching see you next time